Hi Stranglings, it's a little bit of a strange video for you guys today, all the strange, because I'm coming to you live from my new apartment bathroom. Um, the review, as you can see by the title, is Hex Bombs. I finally got mine in the mail, it took about two or so weeks to get here, so if you're from the US and you're looking to order some Hex Bombs, just so you know it is going to be about a two week shipping period, it's coming from the UK. I will definitely have the link down for you below to check out um, directly where the Hex Bombs are on the website as well as the website in general because she has some clothing on there as well that is super cute for you guys to check out. But she restocks every Friday at 5pm, whatever their time is because I don't remember. <laughs> but if you go on her Instagram account and or her Facebook page, you can check out more information about those restocks. Those Hex Bombs are usually, what I was told was they are really hard to get a hold of. But she actually did an early restock. It was like on a Wednesday or Thursday instead where she posted on Instagram, Hey, everything's ready. We're restocking now. And I was like, yes. <laughs> so I bought six bombs, two of each of the three that I got. And I'm going to show them to you right now. Uh, the packaging is really cute. And I'm really excited to use them. This one is Bathory. It's like a bloodbath one. This one is called Black as Your Soul. It makes the water turn like a deep black color. And then this last one is called Nightmare. It's supposed to be like a purplish blue kind of galaxy looking thing. This is the one I'm going to use today because most of the photo shoots and or videos that you see for Hex Bombs are going to be the Bloodbath ones, which is the Bathory or the Black as Your Soul. There's also another one that's like this lime green color. It's really cool. And I think they have one that's coming out or it's out now that's like a, this deep orange. It's really pretty. Um, but... This Saturday, I actually have a photo shoot coming up that is going to be a bathroom shoot, which involves like the kind of, it's like a milk bath, but red. Um, they're not using the hex bombs exactly. It's actually going to be uh, someone that's local in Tennessee who's giving us the bath bombs to use. It's very exciting. I'm going to link the photographer slash makeup artist Constance below. She does Boudoir and Blood and Dark Side of Saturn Photography is her other page. Again, all the links is going to be in the, all the links are going to be in the description for you guys to check out. Sorry that I'm kind of uh, out of it today. I opened at work this morning and it's already, you know, 9.30 at night and I'm trying to make this video and my camera keeps freezing up on me so I don't even know if it's recording or not right now, but we're gonna go with it anyway. Um, <laughs> so Tommy's on the floor over here right now. He's just kind of chilling. He's afraid of the bath water. I made sure to go ahead and already set up the bath ahead of time just so we didn't have that noise in the background. Uh, just to let you guys know, there's already kind of like a, a slight bluish tint to the water because I like to use, it's Village Naturals Therapy, it's like muscle relief. Every time I take a bath, this is what I use because after standing at work all day, my calves are killing me and I have runner's knee in both my knees from a mix of soccer as well as uh, some falls I've had at work. Um, and I've also got back spasms, back spasms, oh my god, back spasms occasionally. <laughs> There's Tommy right there, just creeping on whatever it is that I have. Um, here he is. Hi, everybody. He just got fixed recently, so he's been super cuddly with me. Uh, he hates when I leave him, which has been great. Uh, he's... He made, whoa, he's purring now. Hey. Um, he's a bit of a butthole. He likes to bite like a shark. He'll attack your feet. In a lot of videos in the past, he's bit my feet or tried to attack me. Um... But this is Tommy. Ooh, he wants to get away. Well, like I said, I'll probably post videos of him doing silly stuff later on. But the important part of why you're here is to review the bath bombs. Um, I didn't think ahead of time of the fact that I have a lot of suds or bubbles that come up with this bath stuff. So I tried to move some of it out of the way so that there's going to be a central area for you guys to see the colors happening. So I've never used these before. This is the first time I've ordered them. This is the first time I've opened them. Um, the scent that's on this one, the fragrance, is lilac, and it also has some witch hazel and citric acid in it. Yay, citric acid. Um, but it smells really good. You can see better with the colors right there. It's like, oh my god, it's going all over my computer. It's like this uh, lilac-y, lavender, purple with some blue hidden in it. Um, but we're going to check it out and see what happens Ooh, before I drop everything and you're going to miss the whole thing. <laughs> Some of it's already getting in the water, which kind of sucks that you're missing it, but let's, let's get this going. All right. Ready? That's super cool. It 
it's more of a magenta color once it's in the water. It's not so much of that lilac -y purple. I'm trying to angle the camera so you guys can see it better. It's still fizzling out. It looks kind of galaxy-like, the way that it's spreading around with the clouds. And you can see some of the blue specks over there more in the foam area. It's super, super fuzzy. That's actually really pretty, and it smells really good. I think it's already fizzled out. I'm not sure. It's kind of a deeper color over on this end, if you can see, versus over here, it's a little bit lighter. Deadpool. I'm really excited to try out this bath. Obviously, I'm not going to record myself getting in the bath for you guys, because that'd be really weird. <laughs> But if you check out my Instagram and my Emily the Nicole Strange, Emily the Nicole Strange, hmm, I'm going to have to change the name of my Facebook page now, Emily Nicole Strange Facebook modeling page, um, not only will you see a picture of this pretty color, but you will also see uh, some sneak peeks from a photo shoot that I did this past weekend. It was a uh, Twisted Fairy Tales theme that Sarah Robertson put together. Um, originally, I was just going to go because my friend was going to help out and do some makeup stuff. But I ended up deciding that, you know, if I'm there, why not participate? So uh, I, we did Little Red Riding Hood, if you can't tell from some past shoots, I'm a little bit obsessed. Um, the story of Red Riding Hood is, wow, the original, she goes through some, excuse my French, but she goes through some shit and comes out the other end. Uh, she is a huge inspiration. She's such a badass. Um, but the twist that we put on it was that I was the wolf and my friend actually was a little red so we changed it so that I was the little bad wolf and he was big riding hood I think. Um, but it came out really cool. We had a sword fight. Um, my makeup was done by Sandy. It looked really great. Um, I don't really know what else to say because this is a review of the bath bombs and I can't really review much until I get in it. I know that on the website it says that it doesn't stain. Um, my hand is already getting a little bit pinkish from being in the water, but you can't really see it on the camera. Um, and that's just from moving it around, but it feels, I don't know how to describe it, but the water feels soft and kind of like conditioned. So I'm really excited to get in and try this. And the bubbles are a whole bunch of different colors. Um, I picked these three specifically because the blood one looked really cool. And it's the one that's their most popular, got a lot of reviews. The black one I just thought would make an awesome one for a shoot. And if I didn't do a shoot with it, I also got an extra one just because I, it in the bath. Why not? I love bath bombs. I'm a huge fan of Lush. I use a lot of their bath bombs. These were like, I don't remember what it converted into um, American dollars. I think they're three euro. I'm sorry for the yawn. Um, so they're not uh, really expensive by themselves. Um, I, again, I don't remember what the conversion rate is because it's been a long day and I'm tired. And if I do remember or look it up, I will put it in the description for you guys. And or there'll be a little tag here on the Facebook thing that says, my bad, this is what it actually is. But definitely worth it. Like I said, the water feels really soft. It's a really pretty color. It smells amazing. And I'm super excited to give it a try. So look out for the previews that I'm going to have on Instagram as well as my modeling page on Facebook. Look out for those links below for my friend Constance and her modeling Oh, I'm modeling, oh, I can't wear it today, her photography and her makeup pages, as well as um, going to my account for a sneak preview of the photo shoot I did last weekend. Also on my page will be pictures from this bathroom shoot that we have coming up on Saturday, and as well as, of course, you know, the Hex Bomb website for you guys to check out and buy your own and check out the clothes that she has as well. I am, like I said, super excited to get in this bathtub right now after a long day of work. I hope you guys like this review, that you like the color that you see that was down below. I'll probably show it to you one more time after I dry my hand off because I don't want to touch my computer while it's all wet. And this, if you're willing to wait the two weeks and or to plan a photo shoot around it. My computer is frozen again, but in case it is working, you can see that beautiful color that's coming through right now. Alrighty guys, I am going to get in this bathtub and get all nice and clean. And I hope you guys have a very strange and wonderful rest of your week. And you look out for those pictures coming soon, okay?